I'm Jeremy Peterson. I'm a training instructor with Alibaba Cloud's International Business Unit. The role of a trainer is to provide product-focused training for customers of Alibaba Cloud. So usually that means we're introducing them to what our products do, how many there are, how they match against our competitors' products, and then how to use them. The thing I like the most about the training team role is that you really are expected to know what all the products do and how to use them. Giving the training and hearing the feedback is usually a wonderful experience. It's the reason that I keep doing it. I've been at Alibaba for almost five years. Whatever you're doing at Alibaba, it's going to push your limits. You will be asked to do things at some point that are outside your comfort zone. I remember there was one point where I was the only trainer available to give a training in Chinese, and uh, I had never given a training in Chinese or any talk in Chinese. So, you know, I spent a week preparing. Uh, my wife is actually from Northern China, so I took the slides home and we made cards and I presented to her on this for a week. So you're always having to overcome challenges like that. Sometimes the working culture can be different. People will tell you what is wrong rather than what they want done about it. You're responsible for reverse engineering what should be done. And I get this at home and at work. If my wife walks into the bedroom and the bedroom is cold, she's not going to say, turn on the heat. She's going to say, wow, it's really cold in here. And I'm supposed to know that that's my cue to turn on the heat. And work here works like that a lot of the times too. I need to know that when someone asks a question about why something is the way it is, Usually what that actually means is they want it changed, or there's a problem with it, or they're waiting for your suggestion. So now I know to be more proactive about that. That was hard to adapt to. The one skill that I've benefited from the most, uh, having spent so much time at Alibaba, is learning that done is better than perfect. So in my spare time, on my own projects, I procrastinate a lot, I want everything to be perfect, and then it never gets done. Here, you're always under pressure to get something done to iterate so that you can move on to the next phase and make it better and better over time. Having this pressure to do things quickly and, and to get something out the door has helped me do more personal projects. And I compared the number of personal projects I got done before I came to Alibaba and after. It's not even close. I do way more personal projects now and that has been good for me. I've actually started applying that to other areas of my life as well.